A new business on Westside Avenue is a blast from the past for some, as Fine Fair Supermarket reopened its doors to customers after being closed for years. Mike Ayesh, owner of the supermarket, told Real Jersey City that he reopened the location as Fine Fair because of the parent company and name recognition. Well, Fine Fair has been open for a pretty long time right now, and this is our second Fine Fair store. We like the brand. We like the, 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 cu- the customer service that we get from the parent company, which is General Trading. So, plus, everybody in this neighborhood knows the Fine Fair brand name. So this is the reason why we chose to keep it as a fine fair, even though it's been closed for so many years. Ayesh also addressed whether the issue of crime or the economics of the local neighborhood raised any concerns prior to making an investment. Actually, we weren't worried about the crime because Jersey City is up and coming. We think it's the place to be, and we want to get in on the ground floor right now. We want to get in early because we honestly believe Jer- Jersey City is up and coming. It is the place to be. We Plus, uh, regarding the, the customer support to support the store... I really don't think that was an issue because from day one, when we came to look at the location, we had a gentleman walk up to us and ask us, are you going to open up the old fine fair? And I said, you know, we're thinking about it. And why, why are you asking that question? And he told me straight out, there's no place to go shopping, food shopping around this area. So this was one of our main reasons that, you know, I spoke to my brothers and we decided to invest in this particular brand and in Jersey City. He also added that he was in negotiation with the city to lease half of a public parking lot across the street for customers and said he owed Ward B. Councilman Kemraj Chico Ramsho a debt of gratitude for being helpful from day one. Well, we've been in touch with our Councilman Chico and we owe him a debt of gratitude. He's been helpful from us with us from day one regarding any issue we had. So hopefully uh, we could get that issue resolved and we could lease half the, the parking lot from the city and we, for that our customers can use Finally, Ayesh said that Fine Fair was customer-oriented and that the store would hopefully be an anchor for a neighborhood that is desperately in need of a place to shop for groceries. Well, this is our third store, and we, all, we are very customer-oriented people. We listen to our customers. We get their, from their feedback. If a customer asks us to bring in a product, we will bring it in. If we're able to bring it in, we will bring it in. And when you do that, you build a relationship with that customer. When he sees that he's getting the products that he wants, he's a happy customer. And happy customers are repeat customers. And just off that note, today, actually, I had a customer that told me that he was deciding to move out of this neighborhood until he found out that we are open here. Because he he was telling me the same thing as a lot of customers are telling us. There's no place to shop around here. And so we decided to invest in Jersey City and to invest in the Fine Fair brand. And hopefully this store will be an anchor for the neighborhood. I'm Michael Shuren with Real Jersey City, the talk of the town.